everybody. You're in my studio. This is C. Fernald, Chris Fernald speaking. Call me Chris or C. Anyways, I got some real interesting stuff installed in the Alps, about eight, eight thousand, nine thousand feet up. And I haven't been here in a while. I have, but nothing good. But then I caught this. And uh, let me just show you. This is what I call nepissity sneaking around. Uh, the white down here, I believe, is Atu's moon. This is my take. This spot right here, um, I believe it's a lead object. Let's see what I find. Let me take you to a map um, or a model. But you see all the pictures down here? This show might get a little long, but I'm not going to do part one, part two, because nobody comes back. Anyways, let's give you a view of Atu's moon. This is back in uh, 20, 2020. Atu's moon was small. Atu is, is the problem with all the purple. Atu is the big purple planet. Nibiru is blue and the colors get mixed so it looks like it's blue purple all the time. But this green today is what we're looking at. Okay. Let me show you a little bit more about that green. Nepicity. Now this is 21. Nepicity got a lot bigger. Atu's moon got a lot bigger. Now there's objects in the sky according to this. This is like this red asteroid. Then you got the yellow moon. Then you got our sun pinched off. And I'll show you that last week. Uh, here's more asteroids. This is a skull face, which I don't know what to say about it. I've caught it really, really good. Um, and then the OCG down here uh, is all these different rocks. And a lot of what Phil's showing us, these rocks are coming through like this. But then the sun simulator, you know, the sun simulator is working on trying to hide these rocks with this big lens projecting okay so um, just trying to mix you up blue really dark blue I'll show you that in a minute too so we're looking at the um, the purple right now we're looking at the white moon okay we're looking at the dark green and the pissity now if Istum comes through it'll light a whole area up on fire and it's usually on the right side coming through the lead object right here, um, I think I got it perfectly. So let's go back. And so as you can see, study that for a second. Let me get back. I'm going to try to put a show together and explain this, what I see and how I interpreted it. So that's what we got right there is like an Atu's moon. I mean, that's um, the pissity, the green. Now over here, you got objects going off. Let's do some dehazing right here. Oh, you see that? Little green asteroids. It could be them. Now this right here could be the um, the red asteroid I just showed you. And I'll go back over that. Definitely when you bring the color, you see the green. See that green? Okay, you see the green and you see the white behind it. Let's just go. Let's show you. I'm doing this in a certain way. Um, you got Nepicity is green over here Nepicity gets greener um, right here this one see the green exactly the same the purples in the clouds you can see that reflecting Artu's moon is huge it's actually Artu's moon's like this right now coming up in this photo so you get your bearings with me kind of like if you don't know what I'm talking about just watch you'll learn um, so we got this picture. All we did to this picture was bring it down. You see that right there? Okay. Well, the only way to bring that out more, if I use a... I have a filter that could do it, but I want you guys to just recognize it. You know, there's something in there, or it's either that big, and this is the lead object. Okay. Go on. I don't want to stay long on anything. Uh, here's your purple. Right? It's doing all that... In this is like, wow, this is like, for me, this is like right here. Atu's moon is that big. Huge. It just covers the whole sky like white light. Then you got this right here colliding behind it. Just like in the picture, it's behind everything. Purple, you know, so this is, wow, it's a lot of purple, right? Now, if I do anything in this, I would just, this is the actual picture. I'll just... Bring it down, clarify. You can see the surface a little bit. Um, sometimes noise will help that take away that weirdness. Yeah. And that's just, just so much color. Now this picture, 
it's just a 960 pixels 1280 okay and I'm going to show you these things up closer even with the higher resolution so here you go this is what you would see if you're looking up at Stalden oh what a beautiful green sunrise at uh, let me tell you what time it is it's 6 I think between 6 and 7.30 right now I'm just showing you pictures so only thing else I could do on that is take a quick filter because I don't want to distort these things for what they not are not let's just do this quick filter here see what you get look at that that just separates that planet don't it I don't know what that is but see I do know what that is right there I think that's I got the lead object I don't think it's all two um, let me show you and as we go here I lose what I filter by the way um, again I don't know if this is the same outcome as the other one but mm, I'm trying to pick something that would match it really good yeah see so you got something over here in the dark dark blue right there let me show you and that's just this one segment that I'm doing right now 645 same picture that's the original picture almost uh, just a little bit darker okay and then I think I caught this next what time is it now it's coming at us so look how much greener it gets this was uh, 10 minutes before these pictures I'm not doing these in order but 10 minutes before I saw that oh look at it do that to me ten minutes before that's what you know was coming in that's about the original right there but you can see the crossing over and everything now this is a little earlier apparently that was coming in I can show you this on um, this is 4k now you're getting it right 4k and that was at 635 same picture 4k this one is still 4k tiff it's a tiff picture you get all the details you can see the big green coming right up. It starts backing up. This picture is actually it backing up at 645. These are the TIFF pictures, which means they're 4K pictures. Same sky. Okay, and then you got this right here. I'm not sure. Um, that's 655. So that's after it passes. Okay, we'll go back to the Stalden folder. You can see I got a lot to show you. Um, that's just an epicity. Now, you know, I might just make these fast videos, but what I want you guys to do is to go to every one of them because each one I'm going to teach you about a part coming in. It'll be the same stalled in. I've been coming here for five years from like day two, and I've seen a lot. And I'm going to show you. People said I was catching the lens from the church. That's not a church, by the way, it's a restaurant, a ski resort thing where people go skiing so okay let me um, leave this right here let's do that here's the original picture of that right there see that how much the 4k makes a difference but look at that you can see you know if I dehaze this right now all the way down look at that you see the whole the pissy, like right behind Okay, and so to prove that it was right behind uh, Planet X or Nibiru, the blue planet. I got a, I got a picture to show you, and this is this is your first picture I'm going to show you for the next video. Okay, so I think I'll make these short because people will not have enough time. But the next picture looks like this, and it, it's 7:05. So right there, you're looking at how two came up. But what is that? Okay, gotta run. I'll make another one of these right after this one. 
and I'll keep coming out with them, okay? Um, I don't know what to call this title, so it might be I don't know what to call this title. I don't know. God bless you people.